What if AI wasn't magic at all, but was just logic? Every company has their AI moment. The moment where the magic of AI is demystified and the hype suddenly vanishes. It's the moment you unlock your best thinkers and doers. Everything changes in that moment. When almost anyone on your team can create intelligent automation without writing code, your speed and possibilities are nearly infinite. What if creating your first AI use cases was worlds easier than you thought, and that almost anyone on your team could create AI, and faster than it would normally take to make it? What if you were surprised by what you could do? What if you made AI a team sport? What if your current team could retool and contribute to automating more mundane tasks instead of being automated out of their jobs? What if automating mundane tasks made employees happier and freed them to focus on more important and creative tasks? What if you could build something in an hour that would normally take a developer days or weeks? What would you do with that extra time? Productivity would compound exponentially, and as more and more tasks were automated, more and more time would be freed to create more automation. What if by tomorrow, your team had already automated their first use cases? That simple action could set off a force multiplier that sends you on a path toward operational superiority. The seemingly unremarkable decision to just try a couple of AI use cases is simple. It would be in this brief moment that the AI magic vanishes for your company and an unfair advantage is created. The potential impact of not harnessing AI technology soon enough could be the difference between which side of the force multiplier you're on. What if you are the difference between where your company is and where it could be? There will be winners and there will be losers. Outliers across all industries have one thing in common. They stay ahead of the competition. They create an unfair advantage. You've heard of self-driving cars? We're a team of data scientists, UI, UX analysts, mathematicians, and anthropologists that are working towards self-driving companies. It's not fair. It's OneReach.ai.